That cup of tea you drink every morning starts here, on the tea firms. It's then transported to the largest primary processing tea plant in the world, Jamji Factory, a business unit of Unilever in the heart of Kericho County. The first stage is known as withering. A biochemical process where the tea is put in open containers for between 12 and 24 hours to ensure it remains fresh. At this stage, moisture content is 80%. It then goes to a second withering stage at room temperature for about four hours. The moisture content is down to 68%. The next stage is maceration or the cutting stage. From here, it goes through oxidation where the oxygen is between 18 and 24 degrees for about 130 minutes. It's at this stage that the chemical composition begins to occur and color begins to change from green to the familiar brown. By the time the tea arrives from the oxidation process, the tea is actually at a moisture content of 68%. That tea is fed automatically into the dryer. The tea is subjected to high temperatures in three different stages at 280 degrees, 230 degrees and finally at 200 degrees. The tea spends about 20 minutes within this dryer and within that time the tea will have actually reduced moisture content from 68% to 3%. By now the hot air in the boiler has dried the tea and it's now black in color. It then goes on to the sorting stage where it's graded through a boulder to separate the tea quality. And finally, quality assurance where And this is the end product, made in Kenya with just a dash of milk that finds its way to millions of households across the country every morning. Or every evening, if you're from a certain region in the country like I am. Jolly good. Robert McGillar, NTV, Jumpy Factory in the county of Kericho.